All right, well now I'm going to give you a video tour of my Premier Boundary Water 310 Skydeck boat. Uh, just to give you a quick tour of it here. Here you have one of the entryways. There's actually three ways to enter the boat. This is at the front of the boat. Uh, here you have a love seat chair. Let me show you here from the back, from the back looking forward. You've got a love seat chair, long sofas. In this uh, middle sofa here, uh, down in this area here is actually an ice chest. There is storage underneath every seat as well up here. And then on here, I'm going to show you there is a release lever. And these seats actually kick back and recline for a lot of comfort. Looking uh, from the front of the boat, looking backwards, you've got two captain's chairs here. A uh, little ottoman, which is also an ice chest. And a spot for a table here, which I also own, but just do not have up right now. And then in the floor is storage. Uh, it's a very long storage, uh, much longer than the door opening uh, for skis, uh, water floaties, things like that. This is the area for driving. Again, storage in here where I keep uh, the vinyls and things like that for the covers. Storage up front here, little glove box. And this is the instrument panel. Upgrade is stereo, iPod connectivity. Just to show you here. This is the SmartCraft system by Mercruiser. It's a uh, cable-free system for driving. Makes very, very smooth transitions for speed, as well as cable-free for steering as well. And uh, it's all uh, electronic. The uh, driving seats, um, I have an upgraded seat. It is the dual captain's chair uh, for driving. This is the kitchen area here. And here, uh, we have, uh, of course, a drink holder, which also doubles for a paper towel. We have sink. Again, more storage with, with fresh water underneath. Refrigerator. In here, we have a microwave. And below it is storage for two. Uh, there are two extra batteries. Those extra batteries are just for the electronics, for the stereo, and things like that. This, I guess you would call the dining area with the removable table. Again, more storage. Um, speakers underneath. Again, you have two speakers here. You have two speakers up front plus a subwoofer on the first deck. Behind the seats here, I'm going to open this up. You do have a complete porta potty that opens up. I don't know if you can see it there, there's the potty. It is a pump out head, so no having to clean it yourself. The container next to it here is a fresh water system for, if you needed to, for hosing down the boat. And of course, a very unique feature on this boat is the actual spiral staircase, which goes up top, so no dangerous ladders to have to climb. On top, you've got two matching sofas, again with speakers. And of course, a you can see it here, a full bimini top if you want to open it 
And then this is what the kids love. This is the slide. It does have a pump from the water that pumps lake water up on the slide, which make for a lot of fun experiences for the kids. I'll go back downstairs. On the rear of the boat, we are powered by a 200 horsepower Mercury Verado. It is a supercharged engine, stainless steel prop. We've got boarding ladder for the boat, as well as two rear speakers for enjoying music while you're floating in the water. I hope that it gives you a good tour of the boat. If you have any questions, Please call or if you'd like some additional photos, please call.